What's good, Dollar Squad? It's your girl MK Dollar Sign. I am back once again, guys, with another video. And today, I am going to be doing another reaction video. But today's reaction video is going to be different. I'm going to go on ahead and let you guys in on what is going on with this whole situation of Chris and Queen. I'm about to just go ahead and let you guys know what's happening. I have done a ton of research. I know everything I am talking about. So if you feel the need to feel like I am not saying something correct, comment down below. I will be I will be happy to read what you guys got to say. But I'm just tired of all of this little YouTube beef and all this stuff. I'm just so tired of it. Like, it's just really getting played out at this point. And I just had to come on here because I know Demon Nation had this similar little problem going on. And I just feel like it's just... It's not going good, you feel me? Like, first it was Demon Nation, then it's Chris and Queen. Like, who next is going to do this whole little situation? So, I'm about to go ahead and tell you guys what is actually going on. So, I don't know if I'm being 100%, but from what I have took in from these videos that people be making, it, 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 sounds, it sounds accurate, all right? So, um, from what I have been told is that Chris... Why the cheating no queen? Okay, we all to figure that out. I per me personally, we already knew that. Okay, me and my sisters been established that we been knew that Chris, like we been figured that they was gonna do this type of stuff. Okay, me and my sister, we plan things out. We already know what people are going to do. Okay, we have that type of you know mindset. We have been like just thinking about this whole situation. We knew that this was gonna come up. We knew it. So that's why I'm not really, I'm not mad, but I'm also like, bro, why you just, like, if y'all really desperately wanted that, that views or that attention, why you just saying, like, do something different besides this? But, you know, people do their things, you, you never know what might happen. So, um, basically, Chris wired up, I guess he told Quinn or whatever that he had this little business trip that he had to go on. So, basically, he wired up, um, going to this little club, and I guess he was, he had to take his red ring off because, I mean, any girl that you see, if you see a man with a ring on, that tells you that that person is married, okay? It just lets you know. But Chris did not have his ring on when he went to that freaking club. We already know that. We seen it in the videos. So, um, coming up, basically Chris is sitting by himself, alone. Basically, he's, you know, acting like a loner. He's acting. He's playing the game, Okay. So basically, the girls, whatever, they basically said that they thought he was cute, okay? And to be honest, Chris is not ugly. He is cute. So if me personally, if I see him in a club sitting down and he ain't had no wedding ring on, I would have tried to talk to him too. You feel me? Like, it's obvious. I mean, you can't pick a side because both sides are accurate. So when I heard, when I seen their little situation, what they was talking about, I can't choose which one to believe or not. So they said that, yeah, they thought he was cute or whatever, so they wound up going to him. Now, me, personally, if I put myself in their shoes, I'm not just about to walk up to no stranger. I'm not about to, you know, do all the stuff they did to a stranger that I don't even know about. You feel me? That's not what I'm about to do. That's not who I am. You feel me? So basically, they walk up. I mean, they said that they was standing in front of him, okay? And basically, he comes and wraps his arm. No, he they he comes and whispers in, I guess, one of the ears or whatever and says, um, do you think I'm ugly? And, um, I guess they, you know, they laugh or whatever they said. And then he puts, he said, both of y'all coming home with me or something like that. He puts his arm around both of them. And what else did they say? I think he said that he grabbed a butter or something like that. He basically was acting like he was single. Knowing darn well if I was there, I would have called Queen up and I would have put him on blast. Okay? But we're going to keep it common and, you know, we're going to keep it simple. So, basically, he... They made Snapchats and everything. Now, I'm going to be 100 with y'all. I follow Chris on Snapchat. I follow Queen on Snapchat. I follow their whole little group on Snapchat. You feel me? And um, I was on Chris' Snapchat, all right? And I could be wrong. I could just be seeing things. But I know a couple of days ago or yesterday, some freaking day, I seen them girls on his Snapchat. It was that little, that little light-skinned dude or whoever. They was on the little dance floor, whatever little floor they was. I think it was Denny's. And they was on his Snapchat. I know I'm not stupid. I know I seen them girls. 
girls because when I was watching the video, because I did watch this video, and when I was watching the video, I was like, hold up. I can't be tripping. I done seen them before. You feel me? I be knowing what I be peeping, you know? I be all up in people's timelines because that's just who I am, you feel me? So I've been peeping. So, come to find out, them girls that I did see, they was the little victims. So basically, he, um, I guess he played her and wound up having sex with her, woo woo bop bop. And then she ba he basically dips off the way and go back to Queen. And reality, if this was my situation, honestly, and I was doing YouTube, I'm going to just be straight 100 with y'all. I would not have put in this on YouTube, okay? I don't care if I'm trying to get money. I don't care if I'm trying to get views. I do not care, okay? Money is not that serious to be doing all of this because at the end of the day, you go get so much hate from what you did, all right? Now, again, they could have been like... They could have already had this planned out. They could have already knew what they was getting into. They could have knew they was going to get hate. Because honestly, DB Nation did almost the same exact thing, okay? And if you tie two and two together, even though they lost subscribers, they still gained over that amount that they lost. You feel me? So it's like, I kind of figure like, they probably just doing it just for the subscribers and stuff. But at the end of the day, you shouldn't really, if you're a YouTuber and a fully YouTuber, you shouldn't be trying to do it for the subscribers or the views. It's not really that serious. I mean, I'd rather go out there and get it on my own than to just, you know, just get it for no reason. Like, it's just pointless. It's stupid. So, honestly, I don't really have no say so on this. But, I mean, honestly, I'm, I just don't know what side to pick. Like, honestly, I already knew Chris and Queen. I'm not going to say they're a fraud, but I kind of already knew they had their little, you know, issues. I already kind of knew that from when they played the people with the iPhones and all that. I kind of already knew, and I wasn't really rocking with Chris and Queen or all like that anyways. Like, yeah, they funny. Yeah, Chris, um, Queen can sing. Yeah, they, you know, they the top couples or whatever. But honestly, if you look at them personally, if you see their true colors, you know that something missing, okay? It's a puzzle missing, but I ain't going to hold you guys up. So we're going to go ahead and get to this video. Make sure you guys give this video two thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe, comment, and like. Also, share for your girl because we all dollar squad out here. And we are right to that top. And don't forget to follow my social media sites. Links in the description box down below. And if you guys want a part two of me explaining what I think about this whole situation. Because this is just half of it. So if you guys really want to know what I feel like deep down. Let me know in the comment section. But without further ado. We are going to go ahead and get into this video. Sorry I keep looking at this one. But I keep thinking I see people. We are going to go ahead and get into this. Let go. Hey Let's guys, get it man. YouTube video. I'm Jada. <sighs> I'm like I told you guys. I already YouTube seen this. So. I'm not really going, you know, ago. I ain't going to really be, sp um, I probably will be speaking on it, so let me not even say that, that, but yeah. And I know that's why you guys are here. We're going to get to explaining. Um, I, will I did watch that video. That's the freaking, um, I can't lie to my song right here. Let me pause. Your money. Hey. Ah, 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 hey. Oh. All right. Let's get back focused. Chris. Um, Chris and Queen are is a YouTube couple. Uh, they're pretty much famous, almost uh, two million subscribers for their relationship. They have a little kids together. Basically, some stuff happened. Uh, how many days ago? Two days ago. Two days ago. So, um, just in case you guys don't know what's going on, the girl in the middle is the one who, you know, did it with the with Chris, all right? And then the girl with the poofy hair, she was like the dude that, I mean, she was the girl that, um, he put his hand around both of them. I don't know who the other girl is. I mean, I don't even know if she got nothing to do with this because, honestly, from what I'm hearing, it just has to do with them, too, so I don't know. downtown LA. No, was it in Hollywood? Yeah, it was in Hollywood. It was Friday night, and so this we is some CSI stuff. The booth, and I peeped like a guy over there, and I was like, "Oh shoot! Like he's cute." He was by himself. Like I thought, I was like looking to see if he had a girlfriend around him or something. He didn't. And we walked like uh. in front of him, and we were just like sipping our drinks, and then like I saw that he saw us. So when he came up to us. He like whispered in my ear and he was like, am I uglier? I mean, who, 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 I just, like, it's just too many girls out here nowadays. It's just don't even be thinking, like. I asked him, I was like, do you have a girlfriend? Like, honestly, at this point, a dude, if, like, uh, it's just so stupid right now. Boring. 
Like the but society that we are in is just so dumb. He says, I'm going home with the both of you guys. And I just started laughing like, you're crazy. And Honestly, like, ah, and he I just says, can't. I just can't. And he's like grabbing my butt. And I was really tipsy. And are they sisters or are they friends? That's like, all I want to know. Because if that's your sister and they, and that's just dead wrong. Like they're dead wrong. And if you're, that's your best friend or your friend, that's still dead wrong. So, I mean, y'all really don't, neither one of them have nothing to say at this point. Like, it's just, it's pointless. But then again, the girls, they do have something to say because it's not their fault. They didn't know that he was married. So, at the end of the day, it still leads up to Chris and Queen. I mean, not Chris and Queen, but um, what's that nigga name? Chris, because he is a whole problem. And he's just, like, giving me a hug and he's flirting with me and grabbing all over me. Like, which one of you is a freak? And I was like, what? Like, and then he's like, which one you already knew what he was trying to do if he said that. What the hell? He's what leading you on. You? Like, how are you gonna I, I can't, I just can't deal with people. He like, talking to us some people just don't be using their brain. Conversation. Mind you, like, we have I ain't even trying to comfort nobody, but yeah. like, I mean, he kept no, you gotta think just sometimes. Because the cutest boys or the cutest girls that, that you all be seeing be the ones that be doing the most. I'm telling y'all. Like, honestly, it doesn't even make sense. And the money that they make from it. And that she's just like, whatever. But, like, they kind of... And then he played my girl Queen, though, and tried to say that he wasn't... And then this is what I don't understand. How haven't you seen Chris and Queen before? Like, they viral on Instagram and YouTube. How you ain't seen them yet? We were never told he was married. And then he gave you that his freaking YouTube. And no, you still ain't have the brain to go look and see who this dude was. You just ain't care. That's why it makes me double think and see if this is a prank. I mean, because this could just be a prank. You never know. So, it's, it's just dumb. So, the next day, Chris texted me and he was like, I want to see you before I leave. And I was like, yeah, like, I want to see you too. Like, and then he was telling me, this like, is just you know, so stupid. Like, I just, you should come to my hotel. I don't watch this already, and I just like, can't watch it again, because it's just, it's just so stupid, like. And, like, he's, like, all on me, like, kissing me and all this stuff. After the movie, he's like, okay, so you're going to come back to my place. Just, and uh, obviously, I was stupid, and I was like, I was, I got in the Uber, and then we ended up going back to his hotel, and. This girl that went to his, like, my okay, freaking so goodness. I'm going to get home, and. So, what do you mean how you would get home? You chose to go down there, so you need to find a way to get back. It's I just can't deal with this stuff. Like I don't I don't know, like I don't know what to I don't know what to do at this point. Like you can you could put the pieces together. Um but it's really hard for me to talk about this because I actually really like I actually really liked him. I fell for him, I fell for everything that he told me. And See, this some stupid really, stuff. Like, all right, I ain't even gonna play. I ain't hear all this, so this is trying to get interesting. Oh, we call she him. just said, oh, oh, we should call him. We should call him. Okay. All right, let me see this. I ain't see this part. Let me sit up. I'm about to go to Dallas. For what? Pick up, pick up uh, my Jeep. Hey. He don't got no Jeep? Yeah. Hi. That's the dude I seen, y'all, on his Snapchat. That's the dude I was talking about. That looks, whatever. I thought he was Chinese, though. Or Mexican, whatever he is. Are you going to come see me? I'm, I'm done. I'm done. I'm gone. Somebody. I'm gone. Oh, my God. He played my girl, Queen. I don't want to hear nothing else. He's such a liar. He's such a liar. He's good at that. He did, I'm, I'm done. I'm done. I, he... He just played my girl Queen. We gotta talk about this, bro. We gotta talk about this. At this point, I don't even know who to trust. I don't even know who to believe. Like, it, it, it just is. All fingers are being pointed at Chris. I mean, it's pretty obvious though that it's Chris. That he just he doing too much at this point. Like, if he if he really doing this for the views and he like this a prank. I'm gonna be really disgusted. I'm I'm probably go go over to their channel and report every single video that I possibly can because honestly, this is just getting out of control. Like this dude is really trying to play queen though. Like it's just so crazy because it's like you got a full baby, 
You got four supporters. You got all of these people, and you just doing this. Like, if he really doing it for the money, I would be highly, highly upset for them subscribers because they are just... It, it's just sad, y'all. It's really sad, but I ain't really gonna get on here and talk too much. So, um, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video right here. Make sure you guys comment down below your, your opinions about this topic or situation because I do want to know. But, um, it, or if you don't even know about this situation, let me know if I kind of feel you guys in. But without further ado, I will catch you guys in the next video. Make sure to slam the like button right now. I need 20 likes on this video for a part two. But without that being said, I will catch you guys in the next video. Peace.